A blessed day to everybody. This is Sister L. Isn't it a bright and glorious day today? Indeed, a perfect moment to listen to a story about God's grace. But before I tell you the story, let me ask you a few questions. Have you ever been forgiven because of a mistake that you did? And did you learn from it? I guess every one of us has committed a mistake not only once in our life, and that's why we can relate to Zacchaeus. Now, let's listen to his story on how he changed and transformed upon meeting Jesus. This is the story from Luke chapter 19, verse 1 to 10, The Little Man in the Tree. It was a normal day in Jericho, the town where Zacchaeus lived. He was a tax collector who would gain very rich because he got money from other people. He made others pay lots of taxes, and that's why many people didn't like him. He cheated on his people so many times, and that's why they call him a greedy traitor. While Zacchaeus was collecting taxes, he heard from the crowd that Jesus was passing Jericho to go to Jerusalem, and he was very excited to meet Jesus. Zacchaeus followed Jesus' path, but he couldn't see over the crowd because he was a short man. Because of this, he ran and climbed up a sycamore tree so that he can get a better view of Jesus. He did not care if the people laughed at him. He heard a story of Jesus being friends with a tax collector, so he just had to see Jesus. When Jesus passed beneath Zacchaeus' tree, he looked up and stared at Zacchaeus, and he couldn't say a word. Zacchaeus, come and hurry down. Jesus said while pointing at Zacchaeus, I must remain at your house today. Zacchaeus was so happy and almost fell out of the tree. But the audience wasn't happy and they murmured in disapproval. They said, look at that Jesus. There he goes again, staying with the sinners. Later that day, as they arrived in Zacchaeus' house, he said to Jesus, Lord, Half of my riches, I'll give it to the poor. And if I had cheated on anyone with anything in the past, I will give it back four times as much. And Jesus said to Zacchaeus, Today, you and your family are saved. I am here to save all the lost and hurting people. Jesus then announces that salvation has came to his house. And that was the story of Zacchaeus, a greedy tax collector. His life was changed and transformed because of his encounter with Jesus. He also received salvation. He was truly sorry for the wrong things he has done. So, Jesus forgives him at once. Therefore, he was freed from his sin, he became a member of Christ, and reborn as a child of God. In this story, Zacchaeus transformed when he felt honored because Jesus asked him to come down from the tree and stay in his house. Zacchaeus really felt Jesus' love for him and is eternally grateful for the opportunity of a new life. From a greedy tax collector, he became a member of Christ and a true son of God. The sacrament of baptism is a very valuable gift from Jesus. I can take care of my new life by respecting his commandments and doing my best to not break them at all. By being truly sorry for all of my sins and wrongdoings, I can make a huge difference in my life and avoid doing a sin again. I will be thanking Him for my new life by being loving and obedient as a member of Christ. Furthermore, I will do my best to be caring and loving and helpful to others, especially in this time of pandemic. It really shows that I'm taking care of this new life that I received in the sacrament of baptism. Let us always remember that it's our privilege to be baptized and our responsibility to take care of this new life with Him. This is Sister L, and I hope you guys like that story. Mm-hmm.